like wind in our sails Hold on tight I can smell the shore It's right in front of us If we just hold on tight This vision that I saw Is getting closer every dawn like forever so i'm hoping you don't fall this is actually a new one hi everyone how are you all i've missed you guys so much this is me giving you a virtual cuddle because i've genuinely missed you and i've missed catching up with you guys twice a week so i hope you're doing really well and had an amazing christmas amazing break how are you guys feeling we're back to reality now back to work i've really enjoyed this time off i was only meant to miss one upload and i ended up missing two uploads because I just felt like I needed a little bit more time just to recharge. As much as I missed you guys, I missed updating you and everything. I missed chatting to you in the comments and DMs and just having that like connection with you. And I really miss seeing comments come up on like my new videos because they literally come up on my phone as if they're a message. I really miss that. But this Christmas, I just wanted to have a proper break, spend quality time with Bradley and my family and my friends. I feel like I've done that. I feel really recharged and just excited to go now. And I feel really motivated and really happy. And I'm so excited to film with you guys today. And I feel like we have so much to catch up on because Christmas is finished. All of that content is literally finished until the end of the year. And I'm really looking forward to starting fresh, having a fresh load of content and having a catch up with you guys so as you already see this morning me and bradley are back to a good routine he's gone to work today and i miss him so much like i feel really lonely and i know that sounds really sad but because i've been used to him being here for like two weeks it feels really strange and i'm a little bit like who do i talk to so as you would have seen this morning me and bradley are back we're back to a routine we're back to the gym being consistent so we have got our coach again which is reese i'm sure you guys will remember him from last year we are back with coaching just because we need it we need someone to say to us you're gonna do this at the gym you need to eat this you need to be strict but also someone that gets us as well so we had our first pc back today and i'm aching already but it just feels really good to like be in a routine and get up early and just feel more yourself i've missed exercising so much like going to the gym and exercising it honestly the main benefit as to why i do it it isn't to lose weight or about how i look it's genuinely to do with my mind it helps my anxiety the days that i don't go to the gym my anxiety it could be heightened like completely it just completely shifts not only my anxiety but just my mindset for the day like i really want to have a really good and productive day and it just makes me feel so much better so if you guys are umming and ahhing about starting the gym or a new routine or eating healthy just remember your main purpose and remember why you're doing it and why you want to feel good because Every gym session that I've had, I always feel really good after or even a little bit better. And to me, that is so much more beneficial. And I was saying to Bradley, because he works in an office job and obviously I work from home, it's really important to have that little bit of you time in the morning and just get out. I love going really early. It just kind of feels like I've done my gym and everything by 7 a.m. And it just feels really good. So I'm just excited to be back to a routine. I'm gonna show you guys. Um, my progress and update you guys on, on what I'm eating and all that kind of stuff which I know you all really love and enjoy. I've also done the most simple makeup today. It literally took me five minutes, probably not even five minutes. All I've done was use the Biterry CC Serum. Guys, they sent me some stuff. 
literally i can't believe it i'm gonna show you i've kept it boxed i haven't touched it and they sent it to me i think it was like the week before christmas and i had so much going on or maybe it was a few days before as well as i'm gonna wait and then show you guys in the new year. So they sent me some stuff. But anyway, I've got this on. I mixed it with, um, what foundation did I use? I used the YSL, it's called All Hours Foundation. Together, amazing. And then all I done was add a tiny bit of powder to my face, like the tiniest bit. Bronzer, and then I just used the excess of my like blusher and highlighter brush. And that was it. And then I filled in my brows a tiny bit with a pencil, mainly over here. And then I just went over my lips and then used the By Terry Balm de Rose. Sounds like a lot, <laughs> but my skin just feels so much better. I wanted to feel really fresh today, but not too doled up because I'm staying at home with you guys. But I just wanted to feel like ready for the day. So this is a really simple makeup routine. If any of you guys are after one, I highly recommend it. Um, I could film it for you guys in my next video if you are interested. Sorry if I just talk so much today because it's been so long since we've caught up. I feel like there is so much to just chat about and talk to you guys about. I have been trying to keep active on my Instagram. Of course, over Christmas, I was trying to have like a social media break because it's my job as well. Sometimes it can be really overwhelming. So I was just trying to have a little bit of a break, go on it every now and then. But recently I've been like easing myself back into it and just catching up with you guys. And I was like, what do you want to see in my content? And loads of you were just saying your usual content, your vlogs, chatty. So many of you want to see what I got for Christmas. So I've actually kept most things that I got for Christmas. And I haven't unpackaged it yet, so I can save it for you guys. And it's not, I'm not gonna lie, it's been hard because I've wanted to like use it all, but I know loads of you are asking, so I thought I could show you guys that. So I wanted to show you guys the stuff I got for Christmas. I've also got some house updates. We're changing loads of stuff in the house, so I have that to update you on. Um, we are changing our living room. So our new sofas were meant to get delivered yesterday, but the I think it was the courier or courier company put in the wrong postcode so they were literally so close then they had to turn around and i i can't even explain so i think the sofas are now coming tomorrow so what i'm going to do is film a living room reveal and stuff in my next video which will be like on sunday and um, but i've just got some other updates that i wanted to talk to you guys about and just share and i thought we could have a nice chill vlog and i can share with you guys anything that's helping me within the new year because I know there can be so much pressure so I wanted to share with you my organization and just bits and bobs that I have been doing just to help me so I hope you guys are nice and cozy grab your favorite drink probably should have said that at the beginning of the video but if, if you haven't already pause the video pop the kettle on make yourself a drink get cozy um, and we can have a nice fresh start to 2023 together and I'm really looking forward to it and I hope you guys are as well oh I've missed you the videos are back the videos are back. It's a really rainy and like gloomy day today. So I've literally just popped on my favorite um, loungewear. These slippers, I got them I think yesterday from Tesco's. Honestly, these are the comfiest and like softest things I've ever worn. They're amazing. And I'm just, I wanted to be comfy. I love this lounge dresser. I actually haven't worn it in ages. I feel like I wear this a lot for vlogs because it's just so comfy. I had a shower, washed my hair, and I'm just, I'm feeling really good and excited to be back and filming. So in here are the presents that I got for Christmas. So I'll quickly show you guys them. And then these are some things that I ordered on Amazon. And then also... We have the stuff that By Terry sent me. So I was trying to have a little organization over the Christmas period. So I completely organized all of this. If you guys have watched my previous videos, you will know that this is usually completely full. And I had like a little shelf unit thing here. That is now in my wardrobe room. I'm using it for much better things. And I just thought to myself, I hate having loads of clothes on here. The reason that I got this was for when I'm filming hauls, for this to literally just be in here so I can easily hang up stuff, easily show you guys my haul, and then put everything back in my wardrobe. But it got to the point where this was kind of my extended wardrobe and I just kept putting stuff on here and leaving it. 
and it just it wasn't cool so i completely organized it it's all in my wardrobe and um, i had a wardrobe clear out so that room is really tidy now and it's just so much clearer so i'm feeling really good i mentioned to you guys around christmas time that i wanted to change up my beauty room and i still am i'm only going to do like little changes so i bought a new lamp to go here um, I've got a new lampshade coming, hopefully today or tomorrow. So if it doesn't come today, it'll be in my next video that I'll show you guys. It is insane, like amazing. I changed up this little section over here. So this is very simple. Um, I just wanted it really clean and simple. So I think what I'm going to do is this lamp, I don't like it anymore. I don't know what it is. I loved it when I got it and now I hate it. <laughs> I really just don't like it. So I think I'm going to put this lamp on the windowsill and then move the neon diffuser here and then just have try and like just change up the corner a little bit and um, this is one of the presents that bradley actually got for me for christmas it's from katie loxton and you guys know this is probably one of my favorite brands like i have so many of their things but it's the most gorgeous bag he got my initials on it and it's just so amazing like, i'm literally so obsessed with it we stayed at my sister's on boxing day and i used it and i I love it. I've already got this in beige, but I really wanted the black one. Um, and he was like, it's the perfect present. And I was so happy. So he got me this. Oh, and he also got me this, which is from Katie Luxton as well. And it says, take a note. It's a really nice notebook. Um, so I've just popped that in there. So what I'm going to quickly do is show you guys the bits that I got for Christmas. And then also Amazon. Um, and, then, and then we can head downstairs, see the doggies. I think I might make ginger and lemon at some point today. Because I need it. And I've missed it a lot. So that is all my to-do list for today. Okay, so for Christmas... Um, majority of this is from Bradley. Bradley's mum got me some really lovely things. Um, but I have been using a lot of what she got me. But there is some stuff in here actually. Um, so, so I just got some really lovely little bits of bobs that I have been wanting for ages. And it's kind of one of those things that I was like, oh, it's just it's such a perfect Christmas gift. I also said to Bradley, look on my Amazon storefront um, gift guide. This is good, not even just for Christmas, but for like any birthdays or any presents because it was genuinely stuff that was on my wish list and I thought everyone would kind of like as well. Um, so these were on there and these are really lovely grips. And I thought for when I'm doing my hair and stuff or if I want to put my hair up, these are massive, like they're quite big and because they're matte, it really like helps to hold your hair. So I've got these and I love the colour of them. And then they also come with hair bands which are the same colours. Bradley got me some lovely stuff from H&M. So this is a really gorgeous like headband, Alice band kind of thing. These are really in and I really love them. I do feel like for me they're definitely more of like a spring summer thing. So I'm not sure if I'll wear this anytime soon but I love it. I mean I probably will. Has anyone else got loads of chocolate and stuff that they just still haven't eaten from Christmas? Because I have loads, but of course I'm going to keep it. If you guys are new and you're new to like my, I don't really want to say diet, but like my lifestyle, health and fitness routine, I need sweet things. Like it's just something that I love to have and something that I don't want to like not have in my diet. And I have chocolate most days, so you can still lose weight and have it. It is just all in moderation. It's instead of having the whole tub, you have a couple. Do you know what I mean? Um, so Bradley got me them. Um, these are like the what are they called? Powder puff things, which are really good for makeup. Oh, I forgot about this. Honestly, everything's been kept in here from Christmas Day. On Christmas Day, I was like, to Bradley, everyone's gonna want to see what I got, so I I can't use it yet. But it's, it feels like another Christmas Day because I've forgotten that I had all of this and um, he got me a Katie Loxton purse in black to match the bag I'm really into black and white kind of like monochrome things at the moment which I'm enjoying and um, so yeah a lovely purse which I'm really excited to start using this is something that Bradley's mum got for me and it's from a brand called HA Designs this is something that I've wanted for so long um, and this is a really lovely size jewellery box. You can have this on your dressing table, like it will look really lovely. Or it's just perfect to travel with. So you open it up and it's actually got two different compartments. So this is the first one. These actually clip up. So if you have any necklaces or bracelets or anything, then you can clip up and then tuck it in that little pocket. 
Then there's a little mirror, um, and then you can put your rings, any little bits of jewellery, anything like that in here, and then zip it closed. I took one away when we went to, not this exact one, but one similar, when we went on holiday, and I loved it, but I just wanted one a little bit smaller, um, and I love the design of this, and I think it will look even lovely on your dressing table or in your drawer. I feel like I'm really about like organisation at the moment, and I want it, and I want everything to look really clean and organised. So I think that'll look really lovely in there as well. My battery is flashing. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, we're back. There is a lot. There is a lot of chocolate in here, <laughs> which I'm so happy about. These are my favourite. In one bar, there's 96 calories and you just get your chocolate like craving. It's amazing. Like, I couldn't recommend these enough. And Bradley was like, I know you love them and I get them all the time. This is what I mean. Like I always have chocolate because chocolate is a big part of my routine. And he got me these, which I love. I love these jewels. He got me this gorgeous headband, which is from H&M. And it's one of the ones where it's elasticated at the back. Um, which is lovely to keep you nice and warm. These, I actually have a packet already and I'm so happy he got me another one because I don't know why. I just love having a matching pair. These are also the kind of things that can go missing really easily. These are the no bend clips. Um, so obviously you pop them in your hair. The colors of these are incredible. Um, but every time I'll style my hair, I always pop it out my face or if I'm doing my skincare or anything. And it just doesn't like kink your hair. These are amazing. I usually get them from Primark, but the, the quality of these ones are so much better. More chocolate, because I love chocolate. Um, he got me some lovely wax melts from Yankee Candle. Mittens, which I love. I have these already in cream, so I'm so happy I've got this color to add to my collection. Oh, I never know how to say this. But this is a quartz, like, facial sculptor thing. And apparently these are really good to help, like, depuffing. I need to figure out the perfect way to use these or how to use them because obviously I don't want to get it wrong. But I think you're meant to do it in the mornings with, like, oil or something. And then it just helps to depuff and sculpt your face. So I'm excited to use that. Oh, yeah. And then another thing you got for me from Katie Luxon as well is this bag. So it's got a black chain and my initials on. And this is such a lovely size bag. Like it's probably one of my smallest bags, but it, you could fit so much in here. Um, and it's just so lovely, like so lovely. So I'm really excited. I'm so lucky that I got all of these amazing things. I did get a lot more, but I've just tried to keep the main stuff in this bag and not unpack it yet because I wanted to show you guys. But yeah, I'm so lucky and I love all my little bits and bobs that I got for Christmas. Let me know what your favorite present was in the comments down below. Okay, so quickly, these are some stuff that I got from Amazon. This is the Style Pro brush cleaner. So this is the two in one, so it's also so it's for your brushes, but it's also for your beauty blender as well. Um, so I'm really excited to start using this and just have really clean brushes. But frequently, I kind of want to get into a routine because I feel like every time that my skin breaks out a little bit, it's when my brushes are really dirty. So I think the more I do it, the less I'll break out, basically. The next thing is something, you know, you might think is a little bit TMI, but I think is completely normal. And um, this is a menstrual cup. I don't know if any of you guys have used one of these before. Um, and you basically use this instead of a tampon. Um, and it looks like this. I have a really weird thing with tampons. Like, it scares me using them. I've had loads of horrible stories recently. And it freaked me out, basically. <laughs> so I ordered one of these. Um, I have had one before and I really liked it. And it's just so much easier. So the more like you use it and you get used to it, it just becomes so much easier. So yeah, I really recommend a menstrual cup if you haven't tried one and you're looking for an alternative to tampons. These are really good. Glaze, I've actually worked with Glaze previously and I love their products so much. Like literally, I really love them. By the way, of course I love Foxy Locks and I feel like every time I mention a different hair care brand, someone's like, oh my God, you're not talking about Foxy Locks. These are just completely different treatments. This is like a proper treatment for your hair. So as you can see, this is a conditioning gloss. 
So it's really different. It is a treatment you put on for 10 minutes and then you rinse out. Um, so this is a clear one and then this is the coloured one. I use the shade Sleek Espresso um, and it really does help my hair. So I wanted to give these a mention if you're looking to make your hair you know, the softest and the silkiest ever. Next up, I bought myself this gorgeous bangle, which is from Ted Baker. I'm really into bangles at the minute. So this is my current stack. Um, I've got two. So the top one is from Calvin Klein, which is the lined one. And then the beigey one is from Coach. So I just wanted another one to add to the collection. So yeah, I really like this one. So I'm guessing it's literally as simple as that oh i love it i just wanted another i really do love it i just wanted another bangle to add um and i really like it let me know what you guys think it is like a chunky stack but i'm really into it so yeah that's the bangle and then in here and then in here i picked up some drawer organizers um there's loads of different shapes in here um, and these are for my underwear drawers, which are the top two there, just because I wanted to make them really neat. And I'm just sick and tired of tucking everything in and it just being really messy all the time. So I picked these up, of course, from Amazon as well. These are also the really lovely goodies that by Terry really kindly sent me. It's a duo limited edition set. I'm not sure if this is like a Christmas collection. I'm not sure. But I really like how there's the big one and then a mini one. So if I'm traveling, it's perfect. This in here is the Balm de Rose. I think there's two products in here. Okay, so we've got the normal Balm de Rose and then also this product here. Is this a scrub? It might be a scrub. So I'm really so I'm really excited to use that. And we've got this, which is the Hyaluronic Hydra Powder Brightening CC Palette. I'll open that in a second. Um, this is the Hyaluronic Hydra Balm. Um, and this is a lipstick, this is a mascara, and then also we have a face cream as well. So I honestly, I was so excited when this got delivered because I'm such a huge fan of By Terry and oh, I'm so happy. Can we talk about the packaging? This packaging is insane, but oh my God, this palette, really wish I used that today, <laughs> but I'm gonna use it tomorrow because it just looks insane. Like, like the colors of those blushes and then the highlights. Oh, I love, lo oh my God, it's really, oh my God. How incredible. Okay, very excited about that. So thank you so much by Terry. I am very excited about this. So I've just set up everything to make the ginger and lemon tonic. You guys know I do this every single week and I'm not gonna lie, over December, I hardly done it because I was so busy and then when I had my little break, I was like, no, I'm gonna have chocolate this week, but I have missed it so much and ironically, the time that I didn't have it, I kept getting really poorly. So we're starting fresh again. Um, I have my fresh ginger here. I, I like to grate as much as I can. Then I chop it up and I pop it in here. This is something I literally bought from Amazon, I think. Um, it really wasn't expensive, just be careful with the blade because it is really sharp. Um, you literally just chop up, for example, ginger, you can do garlic, you can do loads of stuff. Pop it in here, it's portable and all you do is charge it and then you push this button and then you can see the blade moves. So it just makes it really easy for the ginger to be chopped up really fine. Then I cut the lemons in half and then I literally just juice them here. I wish I had an easier way. This is probably my worst job of it all, but it is very worth it. So I'm just gonna pop some YouTube on and then make this. I'll pop the recipe that I use in the description box down below. I've used it for so long and it is so beneficial. I 
I just made myself some lunch. Um, I had leftover fajitas, but I just had the mix, and then I mixed it in with lettuce, so I had it like a salad, and then um, natural yogurt, and then a little whipped cheese, and it was so nice. So, um, so yeah, I think I've got about 10 minutes left until the ginger and lemon tonic is completely done, because you have to like let it simmer for a little bit. I've got deliveries here for home. So in the Dunelm one is for my beauty room, which is like a new lamp and stuff. Um, and then in the dusk ones, I have I have some bits and bobs for the living room transformation, and I'm so excited to actually like open the boxes, take everything out and just display it all, which should, fingers crossed, be tomorrow. So yeah, I have loads of house updates. Um, and in my next video will be like the transformation. So yeah, we are doing the living room and then my beauty room. I'm not changing the beauty room too much. Like I said, I just want to change like little accessory bits that are actually quite like statement pieces that are going to completely transform it because I'm just, I'm getting bored of it. It's like having the same office. I've had that display for so long now and it gets to the point where it becomes a little bit uninspiring and you kind of just want to change it up without doing too much so I'm excited about that. So we didn't actually film us taking our Christmas decorations down um, but everything is looking really bare and I love it. So something that's been really helpful for me like within this new year and I've only started using this over the past few days um, is this notebook. It's incredible. I'll pop a link to it down below. I did it yesterday and it's out of stock but with all Katie looks and things they come back in stock really quickly um, and then this pencil case is from there too and then I just picked up um, loads of pens and then like highlighters and stuff from Amazon. I think they're linked on my storefront. I'm obsessed with this. I wish I got AW instead of ARW so it matches but it's fine. Um, so this is the notebook. It is a little bit more pricey but it's one of those that are, all you need to do is buy refills like the pad bit and then you can keep everything in here all organized so I've got post-it notes here these are the transparent ones I think I might buy just plain white ones and um, there's like pockets there's like loads of storage in here bit for your pen and it is such a nice notebook like really nice to write with and I just find it really motivating so if any of you guys are looking for a really good notebook you're looking to stay organized and more motivated then I'll pop a link to this down below as well as this pencil case. I just thought I'd mention it because I know you guys always ask me and I also added it on my Instagram story the other day and you guys loved it. Other house updates, basically all of our Christmas decorations are gone and it's just so much cleaner and just so much more motivating. Like, I love it. I just love having a clean slate. We actually took our decorations down on the 20. 7th I think it's literally we do it every year because at that point I'm over Christmas like I we put our decorations up on the 1st of November so it's always so early so then it gets to the point where you're like I'm just over it now Christmas is done I'm ready for a clean house so yeah everything is all clear the doggies are having a little snoozy snooze aren't you Lottie got a Zara parcel and then yeah boxes and stuff here the Christmas tree's gone um, I was watching Modern Family and it just feels so much nicer. I'm just so excited for the new sofas to come. It just oh, it excites me so much and I cannot wait for the transformation. I'm just so excited for the sofas to come. So yeah, my next video will be the whole transformation and then we can also do my beauty room as well. I mean, if it takes up too much of the transformation, I'll do my beauty room in the next video, like after that. But we'll see, we'll see how we go. I'm really excited about it and I hope you guys are as well. I've been putting like sneak peeks on my Instagram and all of you were like, tell me what you're doing. <laughs> so I'm excited to finally like do it with you guys. <laughs> Here's to the good days, here's to the sorrows If this is a mistake, I know about tomorrow I don't wanna fight no more, cause I don't feel the need no more Okay, so as you did have seen, I sieved the lemons earlier um, and then I just sieved the ginger into here and then you get a spoon and you push it down and I feel like that gets the strongest 
bit of ginger out and you literally just get one of these like jugs i think this is from b&m but they sell them in like ikea and amazon and stuff pop it in the fridge and then i do like one or two shots a day and it, it just it just really helps with your energy, bloating, digestion, your overall health. Like there are so many health benefits to ginger and lemon. It's amazing. Um, and I just love it. It's one of those things that you need to get into the routine and then make sure it gets to the point where you just don't even think about it. You just do it. Like usually I like to do it every either Sunday or Monday. Yeah, just makes the biggest difference. Just spilt loads of water though on the side so i need to clean that up but i think we should do a shot now because it's been a long time okay i have my espresso glass this is from zara home actually and i'm gonna do a big one today because i'm not gonna lie i feel like i need it also i covered the lid in cling film because it was going all weird it didn't look moldy but it was just really damp and it freaked me out so I put cling film over it. Um, so I'm just gonna pop this in the fridge. But cheers guys, if you're doing yours as well, pour it now and we can do it together. I forgot this is warm. Okay, I've just put a little bit of ice in it because it's warm <laughs> and I like mine cold. So I'm using my miniature straw. Cheers guys. Okay, that one was really strong today. I think because it was also a bit warm, it made it so much harder. But like I said, I usually shot it out like that and then I'll put it with like cold water and ice. That's my favorite way to have it. I feel like it just wakes me up instantly. I mean, this way does. I think that's like my more enjoyable way of having it, if that makes sense. Um, so yeah, I love it. It really, it really does help. And now I need to edit and i feel like it just gives me that kind of like energy boost to do that if that makes sense so i've just spent the last few hours on the sofa editing it's been really nice to like get back into it i really like this vlog now i've edited it i really like it because it's kind of like a chill getting back into it vlog nothing too crazy of course i showed you guys what we got for christmas our house updates everything that we want to do with the house and like bits and bobs like that obviously before you guys didn't know that i wanted to upload like the whole living room transformation and the beauty room transformation because it was obviously going to be a surprise for you and i think because in my head i had that set as the first video back that any other video just seemed really bad but at least it's something to look forward to um, and at least that's coming this weekend so i'm really excited to film that with you guys i'm really excited to film that and show you guys finally our living room transformation and beauty room and all that kind of stuff um, and i really hope you guys enjoy this video anyway i'm really sorry if it's not your favorite video i just think it's quite nice to get back into it get into a routine and i hope i've motivated you or inspired you in any kind of way i'm so excited to upload this video and chat to you all in the comments because i've missed you so much and thank you as always for your continued support and love I love and adore you guys so much um, and I just want to say thank you for all the love that you showed last year and the previous years if you've been here for ages. Let me know in the comments down below how long you've been following me for. I would love to know. Are you like a proper OG subscriber where you watch me when I've done like makeup and stuff or are you newer? I would love to know. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching as always. I love you all so much and I will see you in my next video which as you can probably tell, I'm very excited about. So yeah, I will see you guys then. Love you, bye. This is a mistake. I know about tomorrow. I don't wanna fight no more. Cause I don't feel the need no more. No. Just wanna make it stop.